Do you have a favorite Indian dish? Oof. I used to eat so much freaking Indian. Like, I used to eat so much goddamn Indian, dude. I do, I do, uh... I'm trying to think of some of my favorites. I used to love, um... A lamb zyka. It was just kind of different. I used to always like lamb tikka. If I was feeling extra... Extra, like, you know, brave that day. Very often I could, uh... Go for a vindaloo. Hate myself. Yeah, Indi when I when I brought Alice, so Alice is my Swedish girlfriend, when we were uh, living long distance, and I was uh, in England for times. I would get her Indian food, because if there's one thing that isn't terrible in England, it's their Indian food, man. It's one of the beautiful things about once owning the entire world. You got some nice multicultural dishes. And yeah. Uh, also, you know, I, I think bread with dishes is always something that I kind of fail to mention, but the japati, man. I don't know what it is, but those japatis are fucking insane. Now nah, I feel you about that uh, that spicy comment. I I think overall I do prefer Indian food, but my body can't handle it as well. <laughs> so uh Yeah, I, mate, I was, I was a risky bugger, you know. Vindaloo. Is it a foul? A foul? Like, depending on what Indian place you go to, it's fucking hot. Ty, Ty is amazing as well, yeah. The guy that brought this up in chat, were you a hungry fella? Were you hungry? <laughs> You've just gone and made everybody in the chat probably like, damn fucker, made me hungry now. I have to go get some coffee after this. Fala's a British thing though. Oh, it is? It isn't like... Today I learned? I thought it was... Uh... Yeah, I didn't think it was. Or, you know... Didn't know. Yeah, you gotta have a lot of Indian food when you're from the UK, man. There's nothing else to eat. Oh, that is a sickeningly fast barbican. That's an awesome build by our opponent. Let 
Kratos gone. Spray us all. Read the yard. Where are you? Yeah, yeah, we are. All where they hear, then they out. So it's going to gather wood from over there and next to the barbican. I mean, the, the layout's good too, isn't it? It's going to be a tricky one for us to uh, push her up. Now, I, can I get on top of this hill? Yes. Better? Yeah, we we can. Better, we can. Need a hit. Yes. Ek heo gangende. Ek willa. Strel. Yes, sir. Strel for a hot nature. Strel for a hot nature. Fully ended. Strel for a hot nature. Yes, sir. Where's the hot? Strel for a hot nature. Need a hit. Where's Sindon second? He just met my friend Payne. Alright, let's get some of the farm being set up here. Yeah, yeah, we are. Yes, sir. What's the business? Your way, you got out of work. And you were straight border. Yeah, cook litcher. Yeah, yeah, we are. On Syria, straight border. A booger, straight border. Yeah, the school. So obnoxious, isn't it? Ah! Okay, I don't know how he got over there. I think he got baited and outsmarted. But regardless, I think uh, overall, we've done very well for ourselves. Let's get some eco upgrades. Just to make life a little bit pleasant. And I do have a single spearman in the mix, so that's good. I'll get uh, a couple more spearmen in the mix though. Because we do see a stable over there. Now we're getting the some of the eco upgrades, but right now this is more than enough uh, farms to get us into uh, the next stage. Like, more than enough, right? Yeah, I, I I don't know if you guys have had this. Sometimes when you use the hold position button, aka V, stand. Sometimes they end up running away anyway. I don't know if you guys have had that happen to you. Yeah, yeah, 
Let us escort. Abuga, railboard, Iquila. Let's plonk it. Uh, uh, get from there so we've got a new stone gathering here. Oh, can we get that, I think so. Oh my goodness, that was close. That was too close, team. That was a good little pick off there. So bugged. Didn't have enough uh, wood. He even got a market over here, man. He's, he's a he's a G. Ah, that's why I didn't kill that guy before. He had a uh, textiles. That makes a lot more sense now. I was sat here being a little bit confused. <laughs> oh, granaries already. Okay, we'll guide these guys away. And we'll come in with these uh, these mad lads. Oh, 
Ottomans might genuinely be uh, close, or even SDA, yeah, they might genuinely be. Maybe over there? I have no idea, actually. Let's plonk this there for now. We're getting a nice few relics on the go. Which is always handy. The user is two wood lines. If we can potentially secure this, then, you know, we're in great shape. is the um, network of castles. Yeah, this is uh, the wood denial game at this point. These poor spear boys. What can they do? Obviously, a bit of a rough game. I think he had a good initial build, and then got a bit messed up by the um, the archers, obviously. So, like, uh, say if he could do this layout again. Wait, this mill here was this like an Aussie Drongo thing? I think so, right? If I could talk about like the layout, so his wood lines were like here and here, right? If you have it like this, what you could potentially do is put a barbican here and have like a lumber mill here just to be completely amazing for both wood lines, which is very important. Then to get round here, if you have like this walled off, means I'd have to go around here. And if there's nothing available, because where was his gold again? His gold was here. That would have probably been really nice. 